Uh, let's talk about this first draw. Looks like you're heading on the road there for the uh, first round. Yeah, you know, Southern Wells, I always say two things about the draw. The first one is I want a home game. We didn't get that. And the second thing is I want a team that's not in our sectional. And it's nice for us to at least, if we're going to make a trip, make a short trip down. And if we're going to win the tournament, which we've been successful at in the past, obviously, then we want to at least understand that we have to win three games. And no matter who we play the first game, I'm sure it's going to be difficult. And obviously this is a little different for you guys. Uh, you're coming in, maybe not, at, we're not as the defending champions. What's it like? Yeah, that is a little different, but you know, last year a lot of people's success or equate last, last year's team with success because we won the conference regular season and we beat Lures in a sectional. But we did, not, we did not win, as you pointed out, the tournament last year. We got beat by Adams Central at their place. And they have a nice ball club. So it'll be interesting to see how our kids react to that because I would think they'd be excited about getting to the Coliseum. Is uh, obviously that providing motivation then for this year? I would think so. We have a, a really young group. We only have our seven-foot center back, Keith Cochran, that played a lot last year. So we have a new group of kids that have really embraced the challenge. So, you know, it's not like you have five seniors back and they're all mad about last year because a lot of these kids either play JV or sat on the, the varsity bench. So I think they'll be excited to get there and see what they can do. What is it about this tournament that makes it so special? Well, I think the fact that you have so much tradition, you know, and, and then getting to the Coliseum is a big deal for lots of kids. Um, you know, and I think that when they look forward to that kind of opportunity, it always makes things special. And so, obviously, uh, um, obviously the goal is to win it. Right. Exactly. And I think it's a pretty balanced field. I think some teams have had some s tremendous success here early. I know that we've only lost one game. We lost on the road to Jay County. Adam Central's only lost one game to Norwell, who's undefeated. Garrett's only lost one game. There's some teams that have played very well, and I think it's very well balanced. Uh, having this tournament in the middle of the season, essentially, a good thing, bad thing. You can learn a lot about your team either way, it seems like. Right, exactly. When you're trying to prepare for the sectional, which obviously we are, when you enter a tournament format, you can be the best team in the tournament. It doesn't matter. If you get beat on Tuesday, on Tuesday you're out. So you have to be successful. You have to clear that first hurdle no matter who you're playing.